Happy Monday to all you tactical moms and dads out there and non-parents. Welcome back to another episode of The Tactical Everyday Dad. Today we have the CJRB Tigress. Let's check it out. Model number J1919. This one is the blue one. Made in China, as you see. Typical CJRB packaging. Just a little desiccant packet in there. Comes in a plastic Ziploc bag. Manual. Thumb stud opening. Overall length, 8.5 inches. Blade length, 3.5 inch. Blade thickness, 0.12. The steel is AR-RPM9. It is CJRB's proprietary steel. Similar to D2, however, superior in corrosion and toughness. Corrosion resi resistance, that is. Shoot foots blade, DLC coated. G10 handles. Handle length is 5 inches. The handle thickness is 0.16. Stainless steel liners with a liner lock. Interesting backspacer here with lanyard hole. A deep carry pocket clip. Ambidextrous for only, I'm sorry, not ambidextrous. It's only for right hand carry. Um, I am not too sure if you can swap that out. I don't think so. That's two screws and this is one. So just for righties only, tip up carry. I do like these red anodized accents here. In here. It's on ball bearings, large blade, but let's see. Very minimal. Trying to do this behind the camera and it's a little hard here. So there you go. Very minimal. Let's do it one more time. For a very large blade. Overall weight of this guy is 6.38 ounces. So a little heavier than most. Let's give you some everyday size comparisons. Your everyday Sharpie. And your everyday big pen. Toy car. Your Ontario Rat 2. And the Ontario Rat 1. Spiderco Pair 3. And the Spiderco PM2. Benchmade Mini Bug Out. And the Benchmade full size bug out let's check it on the pocket you have any jeans wear a size large glove plenty of room in the pockets you have any golf shorts you're everyday Basketball or athletic shorts. All right, let's put it in everyday parent task. One layer Amazon box. Not bad. About the double layer Home Depot box. For some reason, I think because it was a little bit sturdier, that was easier to cut. Five fifty paracord. 
was my fault. Didn't hold it tight enough. There we go. Nice cleaver like cutting right there. Everyday zip ties. This is the part I'm thinking might have little issues. Not too bad, actually. Everyday milk or water jug. Three nice clean cuts. All right, let's put it through the seat belt test. At an MSRP, around $60 from your favorite online knife dealer, once available, is the CJRB Tigris a good addition to your everyday carry setup? It is a larger cleaver style blade. However, it did perform all the tasks that we put it through very well. The handle is pretty good ergonomic wise. There's not really any jimping on the back. There is these like faux slide gills, I call it, but there's not an actual texture per se. There are these little grooves right here. You can see it there. Like that, that would kind of count as jumping, but not really. Like I can just do that and there is not really much friction, but there is some. This is kind of awkward to me. As you know, most liner locks, it's like right here where your thumb is. This, you kind of have to reach upwards and you're hitting the top corner of your thumb instead of the side of your thumb. So it does get a little getting used to. Again, for a large size blade, very quick deployment with the ball bearings inside there. Great action again from CJRB. It is kind of weird how a lot of knives these days are, they went to ambidextrous and now they're going back to trying to keep this side more aesthetically pleasing, which is kind of weird because you're losing out on lefties, you know, like lefties want to carry lefty, not righty. For me, it's a little larger than I would like for EDC. Um, it's a really cool blade though, very overbuilt. This thing will go through hell and back with you if needed. I love the G10 compared to other blade materials just because it's very textury, yet very durable and lightweight. So guys, again, take all my videos as everyday dad advice. Use it to form your own conclusions on if you want to include this into your everyday setup or not. The choice is yours. Thank you guys again for watching. We will see you on the next one.